couple things I do want to point out. Um, stories that I wrote. Uh, the Heather Town story. Um, if you haven't read that on my website. Um, this week I read a story about Heather Town, who was from Venus, Florida. And she was very tragically killed in June um, when a tornado ripped through her town. And the story that I wrote was about basically how she saved her daughter's life, her three-year-old daughter's life. And I don't know, her story has just really touched my heart. I have written to her family and um, actually got a call from her dad, her dad Elmer. And I'm hoping to be able to squeeze in a trip soon to go to Florida and actually meet her family. And I'm hoping to be able to include her story um, coming up in one of my uh, short collections of short stories that I'm working on and that I will be working on in August when I'm on break from speaking. Yay, no hotels <laughs> for all month. <sighs> Sounds really, really good right now. Um, so yeah, if you haven't read that one, you, it's called Voracious Love. And don't let the word voracious scare you off. If you don't know what that means, it's not important. It's just about love. And if you don't know what voracious means, it just means a lot of love. So <laughs> don't let the big word throw you. You know, if you know me by now, you know I'm a wordy person. I like, I like crazy words. I get a word a day every day in my email. And I know the words every day. I think maybe two times in a year I've gotten a word I didn't know. Not to like brag or anything, but when I was a kid I used to read the dictionary for fun. So I know a lot of words <laughs> and I like to use them uh, when I get the chance. So don't let that scare you off. Just read it anyway. And, you know, if you don't, what I always was told, if you don't know what a word means, just guess or make up your own meaning for it. So make it fun. I mean, if you don't know what voracious means and you can't guess what it means, then, you know, make up something fun. Like, I don't know. I know what it means, so it's not going to help me to make up, make up a meaning. But really, it just means a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Um, we'll just leave it at that. You should definitely go read that.